So the British arrived in the central province of Kenya to find my tribe, the Gakoyo people. And when they arrived, they were like, do you have democracy? <laughs> like, what? Do you have democracy? It's like, um, we just want to dig. <laughs> <laughs> do you have democracy? What is your mode of governance? <laughs> like, uh, our mode of governance is actually very simple. Every family has to choose a representative in the village council. And every village has to choose a representative in the district council. And every district has to choose a representative in the provincial council. But do you have a prime minister? <laughs> we don't have a prime minister. We have someone called the judge. Well, what are the ethos of your parliament? <laughs> well, the ethos of our parliament are actually very simple. Anybody that is greedy, anybody that is self-serving, including all perverts, are kicked out of our parliament. They're like, good grief, you still have anybody left in your parliament? <laughs> And they were like, anyhow, it would appear that you do not understand the concept of democracy. <laughs> so now we are here to teach you democracy. Now get off your lunch. Show, show, show. We're like, oh, where will we go? Go and join the Maasai or someone. No, not the Maasai. Not the Maasai. The Maasai are a warrior tribe that drink blood to stay alive. And to prove his manhood, a Maasai man has a bare knuckle fight with a lion. Like, bam, bam, with a lion. And if he dies, People will know he was weak. <laughs> and everybody will be like, hmm, always knew that boy was a coward. <laughs> now, any mini miny mo, should we take our chances with people that drink blood and have a bare knuckle fight with a lion? Or should we take our chances with people who drink tea and cake and are completely overpowered by sunshine and pollen? 